back at it again uh, next day after my install here. Um, uh, I'm installing my headers and I installed my uh, shift linkage as well. So uh, headers went on pretty smooth. A uh, couple issues uh, or a couple minor, minor issues here. So uh, again, these are LS swap headers. I just got them off of eBay. Um, I think they said that they, that they fit like a Ch Chevelle Camaro old school. Um, but <clears throat> um, I got them for this vehicle, 78 Caprice. Um, as you can see, I got a lot more room. So I figured if they fit in those cars, they'd probably fit in here. Um, so in any case, um, if you can see down there where the collector is, um, it was hitting that, um, <clears throat> that little... Um, the floorboard where it connects to the floorboard and the firewall if you can see right in there um, <clears throat> so I had to turn the collector a little bit to have it clear and it cleared um, so you can actually swivel that collector um, circle it around there <clears throat> and so um, I had it on the top end there where the nut is and it was hitting so I just turned it and it cleared it so <clears throat> that was a little little um, fix that I had. Also here on the throttle linkage, if you can see uh, right there, so that is the throttle rod. So when you shift inside the car, that rod moves up and down. Um, so if you can see, I got a zip tie um, lightly pulling a little tension on that. So that was actually hitting against the uh, collector there, the exhaust. Um, <clears throat> and there's a lot of play in that rod side to side, so I just zip tied it there and uh, it doesn't hit anymore. So um, so that was a little deal that I had to fix, uh, but the throttle linkage went, my original throttle linkage went in perfect. Uh, no, um, <clears throat> no issues there. Everything hooked up great. Uh, I, shift, I shifted in all gears, um, so that went great as well. So the final test would be when the car is running and the drive shaft is in so I'll see how that works um, <clears throat> angle the uh, O2 sensor down so um, so that clears plenty of room there also uh, but those headers look really good on there those headers are only like 180 bucks y'all ship so eBay eBay headers so um, <clears throat> now a little bit more of an issue here on this side so typically you have issues on the driver's side um, and usually your passenger side clears, but for me on this car, <laughs> with these particular headers, um, I have one minor issue. So they're uh, installed just with two bolts right now and I have the gasket in as well. Um, so down on the very end, I don't know if you can see it from here and I don't wanna get under the car, um, but I might have to just to show you guys uh, here. So here, so right there um so these particular headers are hitting that boss right there um and it's just barely hitting um and when i first initially installed it i didn't have the gasket in there and it was a, uh, it was um touching it even more um so i had a lot of a lot of uh space in between the uh, flange and the block um, so I was gonna start beating it here and I didn't want to do that, but I was like, oh, maybe I can Put the gasket in it. Maybe it'll push it away a little bit and that actually helped um, Push it away a little bit. So What I'm gonna do All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to order another set of gaskets first I'm gonna research and see if they make a little bit thicker gasket um, If they don't I'm just gonna order the same set of gaskets that I have for this current setup right now <clears throat> um, and then I have this copper uh, spray here um, that I use for my my other car that I had at a Grand National before and those um, you don't have to use gaskets you can if you want but from the factory they came with no gasket um, so a lot of a lot of the guys that have those uh, turbo V6s actually use this so that's what I used on that so what I'm gonna do is if um, I'm gonna order another gasket to help widen that space in between the head and the uh, uh, exhaust manifold so that way it pushes that point where it's sitting on the block away um, a little bit more so even if it clears by just you know a millimeter or whatever as long as it clears it's good 
Um, so I'm gonna spray this in between the two gaskets to help it seal. Um, so that way there's no leaks in between the gaskets. So that should work okay, because I really don't want to dent up these new headers if I don't have to, and especially if it's just hitting barely, and I should be good. Um, other than that, I think we're all good, yo. Um, throttle linkage went up good, or uh, excuse me, uh, the power, um, uh, what am I trying to say? The um, shift linkage went up good, installed good, everything shifted fine. Um, now I'm gonna attack the power steering lines. Um,